Hey, how you doing? My name is David Duford at BuyLifeInsuranceForBurial.com where I help people like you find quality life insurance coverage uh, to take care of things like final expenses, cremation costs, as well as burial uh, expenses. Today's video, we're going to do a deep dive into Globe Life Insurance and specifically do a review of how this particular life insurance company works so you can determine whether or not what they're offering you is actually the best deal for what you're looking for. So most likely you're here because you have seen repetitive ads your entire life, uh, either through the mail, on TV, maybe online, maybe in a newspaper insert, where you see these ads from Globe Life Insurance. And you usually read something like, for $1, you get $20,000 of life insurance coverage or something along those lines. Maybe you've wondered, well, that sounds too good to be true. I need life insurance, but I'm wondering if this is actually uh, what they're saying it is. So what I'm going to do in this video is actually walk you through Globe Life Insurance's website so you can actually see for yourself how this particular product works and determine whether or not what they're offering you makes sense for your particular goal. So I'm going to show you my desktop, and you're going to see exactly for yourself how it works, and I'm going to make sure to highlight the fine print so you can understand all the details about how the program works. So I'm switching over to my desktop now, and you should be able to see the Globe Life Insurance webpage. This is globelifeinsurance.com in case you wanna follow along. And what you see here uh, on your screen is a $1 buys $50,000 in Globe Life Insurance coverage. So for example, you see term life insurance for adults, whole life insurance for children, and adults and children. So here we are at the term life insurance website for Globe Life. And what we're going to do is just walk through the application process. I'm going to start with term life for adults. I'm just going to put in some uh, basic information here. So uh, as I like to do in my videos, we're going to just make up a bunch of information. So we're going to just make a 50 to 64, submit, no thanks to the kids coverage. And what's coming up is the free quote. And again, what we're going to be looking here at, and you notice this asterisk here. We'll get to that in just a moment. Uh, that just means that it's a dollar for the first coverage, and then it goes up the remainder of your life to a higher price. So let's just do one adult, get a quote. We've got Mickey Mouse, birthday. We're just put January 1st, 1950. Keep it simple. Now we're at the screen where we see some personalized life insurance quotes for adults, and this is what you get at different levels of pricing. So all of this, again, it's a dollar for the first month and then it goes up. What I'm more concerned about with, and what you should be concerned about with, is, is how does this program work, not just in the first month where you get it for a buck and then goes up, but what about the long term? What are the implications of keeping this plan for the long term? So what we're gonna do is click on policy description here, and if you read down here, this is probably going to be the smoking gun. So I'm going to highlight this, zoom it in, so you can read. This is a term to 80. The initial term period can be 1, 2, 3, 4, or 5 years in duration, depending upon the issue age. All renewal term periods begin at the quinquennial plus one age. Well, that's a new one. And will be five years in length, except for the final term period. The final four-year term period, always beginning at age 76, will expire and the policy will terminate at the policy following the insured's 80th birthday. So let me explain what this means. What this means is that if you take this plan out, no matter if you get 5,000 all the way up to 50,000, no matter what your age is that you're eligible to qualify for this, once you reach, reach age 80, they completely terminate you again. Go back, reverse this video, read the fine print I highlighted. This is on their webpage. It terminates at 80. On top of that, you'll notice that there are price increases, okay? There are price increases that last five years in length, except for the final term period that ends at 80, so it's four years. But there is going to be incremental price increases. So what starts out affordable, it goes from a buck to whatever it is that you eventually choose, it's going to steadily increase until it hits 80 and then cancels out entirely. So that means if you put yourself in a scenario, which you might be, where you're on a fixed income or perhaps on a tight budget, Imagine not being able to afford the insurance you've paid diligently on for many years, but just because you've gotten a year older and you entered that new price range, uh, uh, that's not fair. And it's not necessary because there's insurance products out there that don't require this to happen. 
Again, if you're looking for term insurance, if you feel like this is the right kind of plan that works for you, you can go to buylifeinsuranceforburial.com, send me a message. There are term insurance plans that will last up to age 80 and never have price increases. So you have the ability to find term policies that will be more conducive, more affordable, and not have these price increases that jump out all of a sudden. On the flip side, if you're worried about having a plan that cancels and you don't want that, there's also what's called whole life insurance coverage out there. And what that's designed to do is basically, bottom line, fully cover you uh, if you can qualify from the first day for natural and accidental death, but more importantly, not cancel due to age or health uh, because you hit 80 years old. As long as you pay the premium, you still keep the plan until the day that you die, even if it's well beyond 100 years old. So it's permanent protection. It's not designed to go away because you got too old or something crazy like that. So I say all this because you've got to match what kind of insurance that you are looking at with what your goals are. So if you're in a position of being a senior citizen or maybe you're shopping for your mom or your dad or grandparents and you're looking for a burial plan or a plan to pay for burial or cremation expenses and any final expenses, how would you feel if you live past 80 or they live past 80? Would you still need the insurance? Likely you would. So getting a term insurance plan like through Globe Life Insurance just doesn't make any sense, right? Because you'll have, they may outlive, I can't say for sure, but it's a lot of wasted money if they did, whereas you could have got a plan that doesn't cancel at 80, keeps your premiums locked in, and provides permanent protection regardless of the age. And that's what most people who are seniors, usually 60 and older, definitely younger too, but people looking for final expense protection purchase over term insurance because of its the natural design of canceling. And it's not just Globe that cancels because of its term insurance, it's any kind of term insurance. So you got to match the goals of the term insurance with the um, uh, with what your goals are too, or the, the goals of the insurance with your particular goals. They got to have a good uh, match. So uh, as far as how you can qualify for this, there are health ins- questions involved. If you wanted to go down the route with Globe Life Insurance, it's totally, uh, they're, they're going to ask you about things like diabetes, cancer, heart history, health issues. You may, you may be able to qualify, no problem. However, there are circumstances where I've come across clients that got declined with Globe because they had some health ailment that just wasn't sitting right with Globe. But with my companies, we were able to get them qualified for life insurance coverage. Uh, so what those conditions are just totally depends. Sometimes it's a combination of issues. The point is, is in my business at buylifeinsuranceforburial.com, I'm a broker. We shop around. Our goal is to try to find you the best price and the best coverage as opposed to sticking with one company. So we listen to your goals, what it is you're looking to accomplish to find the right kind of plan, but then also shop the major carriers to see what your options are out there in order to help you get the best deal because that's what it really comes down to. So the moral of the story here on this video is don't accept the first option you see. Not saying that Globe Life does not do a good job. They do a great job if you qualify for it and if you understand the limitations and the restrictions of how the plan works. And if that works for you, great. But if you're looking for permanent protection, if you don't like the idea, if you fear outliving your coverage and, and potentially being in a position at 80 or older, still needing insurance, and now you've got to go out and buy new coverage, if you don't want to be in that position, then a whole life insurance or permanent type of product that we can help you at at buylifeinsuranceforburial.com is the perfect solution. Here's how you can learn more. My suggestion is just give us a call. You can call 888 0439 You'll either reach myself or one of my professional team members to help you figure out what your options are to give you a quote. It takes about five or 10 minutes to do that. You can decide if it makes sense for you or not. Otherwise, you can go to my website. It's buylifeinsuranceforburial.com. Uh, click on the message button on the left side or the bottom of the screen and just let us know what you're looking for and we'll be happy to help you out. My name is David Duford. Again, at buylifeinsuranceforburial.com, 888 626 0439 Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.